shot of the desert as we go into the time lapse shortly. Hope you enjoy. The drive up was pretty smooth. Very comfortable ride. I mean, I think this vehicle is probably the most pleasure to drive of all vehicles I've owned. It's very um, non-exhausting, <laughs> put it that way, for a long drive up to Mammoth. A couple of days of skiing. My daughter was a very good co-pilot. And then we stopped at Inyo Kern for charging. And then headed back up the, uh, headed up to Bishop for our next charging at another Rivian charge point. Uh, of course, we hit a lot of rain as we headed up, which was great news because that meant snow up in Mammoth. Um, most of the road was not open freeway, so I wasn't able to use um, the driver assist that much except for um, keeping my speed. minutes to charge this next stop. A little wet here in Bishop. And uh, we made it. Oh, there's my daughter. <laughs> Having fun. There's the other wood here. Same color. Met them at the first charging, but now it's wet. No one wants to come out in the rain. The sunroof gives a cool effect with the rain on it. And then uh, our drive up from Bishop up to Mammoth Lakes. As we got further up the mountain, we started hitting snow on the roads. Um, it was nice not to have to stop and put on chains. Uh, for the, <coughs> the all-wheel drive. Of course, at this part of the drive, I did not have the snow mode installed yet um but it worked fine so we made it up here to mammoth uh, i'm installing the latest update so i have snow mode since we came through a lot of snow um and you know, it'll take a little while but hopefully that'll improve the handling when we're up here because there's snow everywhere yeah <laughs> with my daughter, the Holy Mammoth. We had a couple of days of skiing, which was nice. First day was beautiful sunshine. Second day was a little cloudy. A little picture of how useful it is just to throw everything in the back of the Rivian. Then we headed back down after three nights up in Mammoth Lakes. And uh, road conditions on the way down was pretty clear because um, it hadn't snowed for a while. And uh, so it made it a lot easier on the, the way down. Uh, it's great to use the regenerative uh, feature of the vehicle. <laughs> so hardly used any charge heading down into Bishop from uh, Mammoth. And um, it's a little uh, more busy as we were heading out of town. Okay, the vehicle looks like it's getting ready to charge. Plug green. It's a nice SUV charging as well here. to go to get charged.
the ship uh, charging station here for Rivian. It charged up for about 20 minutes. We've got two and a half hours till we get home. I really enjoy the Rivian. I consider it like buying three vehicles in one um, on the freeway. You can put it in all purpose or conserve mode and standard height. Um, I have it adjust for efficiency and it's just like riding a Cadillac. I put it in sport mode and it's like a sports car, tightening up the suspension and handling. Um, and then also it's a, a very capable off-road vehicle as I've showed in prior videos. Um, so, you know, I just think it's, <laughs> instead of buying three cars, you can just buy one vehicle and it'll serve uh, multi-purpose sort of uses. And I like having the, um, the bed of the vehicle for all kinds of uses. Um, you can throw so much gear in this vehicle, including the front and the right, gear tunnel. It's like 20 minutes here, Caribbean station in... No other Rivians here. Usually there are. Look at all those Teslas over there. But... I did get a uh, pretty good mileage coming down, uh, 2.54 miles uh, per kilowatt hour. I met some other great Rivian owners on the trip down. Um, and, and charging time wasn't too bad. And right now, of course, uh, Rivian's charge points are free, um, which is great. Uh, we had a you know nice trip back home. We did uh, hit one accident on the way down. Um, a car caught on fire, so it was, <laughs> you'll, you'll come upon the traffic here for a little bit. Um, and then, you know, uh, and then of course the usual traffic as we come back into LA, uh, just to feel like you're coming back to the world again uh, from being up in the Mammoth, which was a beautiful trip with my daughter. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.